It's a downright shame to many drivers. This woman, 53-year-old Ruby Marie Buvasevich, is suspected of driving drunk yet again. Court records show she was convicted of a DWI in 1992 and 2003 and served probation both times. But now, police say she's facing two counts of intoxication manslaughter for killing two women. She's suspected of driving drunk on Highway 90, jumping a guardrail near Callahan Road just before two early Sunday morning and hitting a small sedan head-on. On, killing both 28-year-old Raquel Cooney and 48-year-old Kareen Hollingsworth. While drivers think a third DWI should continue to be a felony in Texas, others say two times caught drunk behind a wheel should be enough for a felony charge in this state. You know, why should there be an exception for this law? You're shaking your head. Why? Because that's outrageous. I mean, because that second time could be somebody's child or somebody's mom. That's too much of a risk. You know, they didn't learn the first time, and then again, well, yeah, I mean, that's somebody's life that can be taken, and usually it's not theirs. San Antonio, it, it's really bad, it's, and, you know, we, we really need to um, take some stricter laws and make it harder for people, you know, make them think twice. One victim is from Lubbock and the other is from Round Rock. If found guilty of the second degree felony, the suspect could face anywhere from two to 20 years behind bars. Reporting live from the Bear County Jail, Christina Coleman, Fox News at 9.